Day three of being sick and day three uh, still vlogging. What is going on guys? Today we are back and today I hope you guys are all having a great day. My grandma is gonna be here in about an hour and a half and then we are going straight to California. My family started the drive there yesterday and I was like, yeah, I'm not getting in that truck. That would be horrible. So I'm flying. My sickness is progressively getting worse, but I'm gonna tough through it because I don't give a uh, I'm actually packing my bag a reasonable time before we leave for once taking all this important stuff You know most of my stuff's already with my mom, but I'm only gonna bring a backpack My flight leaves at noon It is 9 18 and then I get there around 4 o'clock their time and Dylan Hawk is picking me up If you guys know him and I better not leave out this bowl. Oh my god, that'd be horrible a whole month Imagine the science experiment. Oh, um, that was my last vitamin. I better be able to fly tomorrow Like I literally finished this whole thing. Like you better give me some f superpowers. Let's go to the airport <laughs> Thank you for taking me, Grandma. Flying alone kind of sucks, but it's way better than driving still because it's way faster. I have a blanket and I downloaded some Big Time Rush episodes. Thank you. Flight got delayed another hour. Might as well strap these bad boys on. You already know I brought them. These are the only way to make traveling alone better. Luna wants the hell out of this car. So where, how far away is our house thing? An hour and a half. Hour and a half. I guess Rose can sit on me, cause I'm not driving. <laughs> Luna is trying to get up here. I'm trying to do it without hurting her. <laughs> so we are on our way to the house right now, the rented house, and uh, bless you. We're all sick now, awesome sauce. I'm gonna continue this vlog tomorrow cause I didn't upload today, which is yesterday to you guys. I'm so sorry, I'm the worst YouTuber ever. I was sick, I was traveling, no internet, all this BS. We'll have the house reveal tomorrow when we're all settled in. Bye. The next day. Oh shit, I left my camera out here last night and it's cold. Mom, I cannot wait any longer. For what? For what? Yeah. To show these people this house. Go right ahead, I feel sick and tired. You feel sick? You, you feel sick? I had four hours of sleep yesterday and I drove for three hours. Good night. Go get more than four hours of sleep. Welcome to the sick club, by the way. Guys, it is morning now. First of all, my bed is so freaking soft. I got a great night's sleep. I'm still sick, but this is the new house in California. It is so sick. It is perfect for everything that we needed. Perfect for the dogs. Perfect for like a first house here to test out living. We got a shed bro but i'm walking down the driveway right now because i want to show you guys like how much room there actually is oh god they're not supposed to be out come on come on so that whole thing's our driveway it like goes and loops and blah 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 to the road and then it goes all the way up there and this is all ours guys i titled my last video my last day as a country boy that's false dude this is like a new beginning of me being a country boy inside girls inside yeah they don't have collars anymore so inside yo are these lemons what the frick is this? Dude, those are f***ing lemons, bro, and they have ants on them, but oh, we got lemons! Anyway, yeah, there's that shed I showed you, uh, driveway loops around there, and here is the house. You're looking at it, and you're like, it doesn't look like much, Tanner. Blah, 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 blah. Or you're really appreciative that we have a house at all, and you're a really nice person. Anyway, it's super sick inside. I'll show you guys. Whenever my mom showed me a picture of this house, I was like, mm, yeah. But I freaking love it. Look, we got turf in the front yard. Rose, come on! Get your ass inside. I just realized how many lemon trees we actually have. Dude, we have unlimited lemons. Inside, girls. Girls! Oh, yeah, another thing is I can be as loud as I want. Anyway, here's the living room, guys. It's pretty sick. This is like the first living room, I guess. Pretty freaking sick in here. We got a dining table, walks into the kitchen, and then here's the second living room. It's got the TV. This goes into the backyard. You girls want to go into the backyard? Well, too bad. I'm not revealing that yet. Pretty sick kitchen. This is my mom's bathroom, and then the laundry room, and here is the garage. <laughs> we got a ping pong table. We got foosball. We got air hockey. We have everything. Laundry room, and here's my mom's room. Good night. Oh, Luna's staying with you. Fine by me. Wait, what do you have, Luna? What do you... Is that a She has a dead lemon. Give me that. And if you go from the laundry room, it goes straight outside. Here's like the dog space. It is perfect because it has a small gate that is just 
amazing. And from the kitchen, you can also walk outside and then look at this. This is like the actual backyard and then the dogs can like stay over there and then like not ruin stuff. But okay, onto the bedroom. It's right down this hallway. So first room, Tristan's room. Hi. Second room. Taylor's room. Can you stop screaming? <laughs> no. Taylor and Tristan's bathroom. And then finally, my room. My room is so freaking awesome. It's got this couch. It's got this soft ass bed. It's got all my tissues because I'm sick as a dog. I have a big closet. Pretty, I'm um, probably not going to use it. I don't know. I love my bathroom too. Uh, there's the subway I had last night. The shower has like a light up there. Like a whatever you call that. Sunlight, sun, something. It's got that window. I mean, it's basically perfect. And the best part, you walk out from my room straight into the backyard, guys. Check this out. It is amazing. We got the hot tub. We have the pool. They're about the same temperature. The pool is so warm. What? What, girls? What? Do you girls want into the backyard? All right, come in. Come in. <laughs> oh my gosh. And then here is our view, guys. It looks so much better in real life, but like the sunrise this morning, because I woke up early because I'm still in Kansas time, was so freaking beautiful. It was so sick. We have more lemon farming places over there, I guess. And our backyard doesn't end here. Like it goes all the way down along those trees and down there. We have three acres. Back home, our entire house and our side yard is one and a half acres. We literally have twice as much land. It is so sick. And we already jumped off the roof into the pool last night you guys already know it here's a clip guys there is some serious running room up here oh that is so sweet we don't know how deep it is we don't know how cold it is let's send it oh it's gonna be cold guys oh gosh ah! that was not intense at all compared to like the normal stuff. the normal stuff you do yeah how deep was it it was pretty deep probably really? five feet whenever i jumped in i felt all the mucus in my nose like hit my forehead oh, oh yeah that actually feels nice. Yeah, it's actually nice. This pool is literally filled to the brim, guys. We jumped in it last night and it splashed hard. <laughs> I think the pool is like five feet deep, but it's good enough, dude. What do you girls want to do today? Well, actually, I have to go to California. I'm going to that celebrity counselor therapist person. My first session with him, I think it's like a two hour drive, but ask me if I care. No, this house is perfect. It's like a combination of Kansas and California. And even though it is like pretty far away from everything, that's what I wanted. Like, I love this place. So we're staying here for a month. We might buy a house here and we'll still go back and forth, you know? I don't think I'll ever live in one location forever. I'll always go back and forth, right, Luna? They hated the car right here. They want to stay somewhere, don't you? Don't you? Oh, yeah, we got a little fire pit, by the way. But yeah, guys, I'm so thankful for this house. It's so sick. Oh, it's 8 in the morning. They're doing their first swim right now. I'm surprised they didn't jump in last night. Oh, 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 come on. No, Luna, do you know how to attack her when she's not out? Oh, okay, well, I'm closing <laughs> this so they don't get in. That's awesome. I've never seen them get out like that. Dude, that pool is filled to the top. That's why they could do it. And also, guys, my mom and I were talking this morning, and we were like, why do we have so much shit back home? For one, I stay in the basement, and that's like, you know, the same size as this whole house, which is completely fine for me. I basically just stay in my room. I don't use the move room or, like, the downstairs kitchen. I told you guys that a million times. Whenever I stayed home alone without the dogs or my family, I was pretty sure someone was sitting in the beanbag room with a straw breathing living in there, or someone was, like, you know, there could... It's just too big. We bought it for clickbait. It worked for clickbait. Still is good clickbait. I mean, I like it, but I mostly... It's, like, my colorful room. Well, I used to, but then I moved everything for a picture that was big. I'm gonna enjoy my cereal. I like, I literally love the view more than like having a big house back home. And I get my Audi R8 soon, like this would just be perfect in my opinion. I don't know. We'll see what happens, but I know what's gonna happen for now. Me eating this cereal. Wow. How nice is it driving your own truck? Nice, but look at what the dogs did. There's a blanket in the back for a reason, and that's <laughs> Luna's hair. Guess what? My lanyard kind of matches my shirt. <gasps> And boom, we're already basically in Los Angeles now. So that was actually faster than what we thought. The drive wasn't that bad. And if I was in my Audi R8, we'd already be there as of like 15 minutes ago. I just got off the phone and it's apparently gonna be like another week. Ah! It's gonna end up being like eight weeks without my car. You know how long that is? Eight weeks. Eight weeks. We even got here a little bit early. We're gonna go in there, talk to a guy, and we'll see you guys after. Whoa. Five minutes later. We are back. That was pretty cool. <laughs> now we're going to a concert. I don't really listen to rap music that much. This is a day and night concert. Uh, that's the name of it. I don't know if it's actually day and night, whatever. Um, No matter what, I'll smile and wave and be like, keep on going, yeah. And then everybody else around me will be like Quentin and be like, yeah. 
Dude, that stadium's big. Is that is that a baseball stadium? Dude, I could totally hit that out of the park. Angel Stadium. There it is, everybody. I already smell the Mara Wieners. Guys, this is the official Jim's tent. Look at this stuff. It's freaking lit. I'm just gonna hang out here, bro. Thanks. Out here getting lit. I think if I ever get a high in my life, besides like the dentist, it's gonna be here. I already feel like sick and my mouth is dry. Dylan Hawk is on his way here. We got him two backstage passes as well, and uh, he'll enjoy it a lot more than me. I'm here for the social aspect and the dibs, boy. So as you guys know, I am one of the owners of Dibs Clothing. Two other owners, one of them is Zach over there. You know Zach. The other one's Courtney, the guy with the backyard cliff. You already know. He has done a lot of concerts in his life. Like he loves putting on shows. He pays the artists to show up, right? Well, all of this, was Courtney, the third owner of Dibs. Absolutely insane, absolutely incredible guy. The guy doesn't even go home to his $20 million house because he loves working, he loves doing stuff like this. And now it's this huge thing and we got Dibs everywhere. All right guys, it is getting dark. Friends are on their way, we're having some fun. So I'm just gonna end the vlog now. I will see you guys tomorrow. Hopefully you enjoyed this video, new house reveal. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed, subscribe if you're new and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. It ain't my fault.